What's up guys? Today we're watching season 3 episode 11 of Breaking Bad. So last episode was pretty slow, you know, they were basically just spending the whole episode trying to catch a fly so the shit doesn't get contaminated. But in that episode we did get to see like a different side to Walt, you know, he seemed a bit more emotional and like vulnerable. And it was kind of like interesting to see really and what's it called? Even at the end of the episode, he basically guessed that Jesse was taking a little bit of like the extra meth that they were making and he was trying to warn him to be careful about it, which I was surprised to see. But you know, I was happy that he did that. I was surprised he wasn't mad, but like he warned Jesse and I love that. But besides that, I don't really know what's gonna happen this episode and I'm ready to get into it. So I guess let's just get into the episode. Oh, I thought I was gonna see some like vaginas. What? I didn't say she actually painted vaginas. I said some of her paintings looked like vaginas. I didn't think we were gonna see Jane this episode. So they actually went to the museum? Well then why should we do anything more than once? Should I just smoke this one cigarette? Maybe we should only have sex once if it's the same thing. I look at like how she gives him a different perspective of shit. In this kind of case, you know. The universe took her to a door and she got all obsessed with it and just had to paint it 20 times until it was perfect. He's just obsessed with the fact that it's a fucking door. Leave it be. Oh, it was so sweet. I think I threw up in my mouth a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. You ready? Hank! Come on, give me a step. Give me one step. Physical therapy. Come on. It's supposed to hurt. Pain is weakness leaving your body. Pain is my foot in your ass, Marie. Hey, if you can get your leg up that high, I say go for it. Damn. <laughs> she just took it. He's just... Coffee, baby. Take me up. I'm done. I'm done. <clears throat> He's just struggling right now, but I mean, that's what happens in physical therapy. It's not fun. How else are you going to get out of here? Don't you have any friends? I mean, Jesus. Find something better to do. I don't even staring at me hanging here like Kim's ball sack. Damn. He's just extra angry. We got our first bell. And, you know, if you're still insistent. I am. How much is it? Oh, that was the meth? I didn't real. Why did I not realize it came out like that and they had to break it up? Is Walt trying to make sure he doesn't take the extra? This is bullshit. Just say it. Just say the words. You think I'm stealing. He's trying to keep it on the down though while well, you're trying to out your own self. So... No judgments. You can be as open and honest as you want to be. Honestly, I don't want to be here. No one wants to be there, bro. Well, hello? My name is Brandon, <laughs> and this is, I believe, Peter. Hi, I'm Peter. How are you? They are not doing that well, but I guess it's believable to everyone else. So, uh, how's it selling? Mad volume? Yeah, it's, uh... 
it's not doing that well. Look, it's not so easy selling to these people. They're here trying to better themselves. Yeah, there's like positivity and stuff going on. <laughs> That's the point of the group. It was stupid to go there. It's not natural. Yeah, Jesse, it's not so easy like you think. I'll show you exactly how easy it is. It, that's gonna bite him back in the ass because he thinks it's that fucking easy. Oh, hey, sorry. No, go ahead. Andrea, right? Yeah. Hey, um, my name's Jesse. Don't tell me he's gonna try and sell to her. Next Thursday is officially six months I've had my learners. Which means I can get my provisional and start driving by myself. Hell yeah. He gets his at 16. I didn't get my license until I was 18. <laughs> We should probably table this discussion for later. Your dad and I have a couple of things we need to talk about, so. Okay. Is she finally gonna say how much it is? It's a loan out. It's fine. Who's loan out? It's fine, really. He's not gonna tell her about how he's still making shit. What's his name? What are his qualifications? Walt, this money has to be unimpeachable when it reaches Hank and Marie. It is. We got Saul on our side. Oh wait, is he still doing that? Or is it Gus now? It's making me mix it up between him and Jesse, man. Why is that lady just staring? Prior to recent unfortunate events, uh, clearly his taste in women is the same as his taste in lawyers, only the very best with just the right amount of dirty. Damn, Saul. What an opener. Presented uh, by, say, Saul? these jelly beans. Uh, you know, I'm I, a bookkeeper, uh, so I actually, I know what money laundering is. Uh-huh. Well, <laughs> you don't need to go through all that. Walt here actually came up with a great story about gambling winnings. It was blackjack, right? Some card counting. System. Um, well, actually, that was Skyler's. Idea. Yeah, that's all her. Become seed money for an investment. Investment in what? Drum roll, please. Wait for it. Laser tag. They both don't look impressed. Is that in relation to Walt, it's, I mean, <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Makes more sense than you two being together. I'm still trying to figure. Damn, he switched up quick. This, it, it doesn't add up. It adds up perfectly. Walt's a scientist. Scientists love lasers. Plus they got bumper boats, so. That low-key didn't make sense to me, but... Okay, because I've been doing this for a lot of years, successfully, believe it or not, without your help. So, <laughs> thank you for stopping. He, he's got a point there, but then she also has a point. Like, it don't make too much sense, but you know what? We're gonna roll with it. And okay then. Straight up. I know. It's just... What? I can't get caught using it yet. If you push it on her, we're gonna fight. Not to get caught. No fucking shit. No one wants to get caught. And they try not to get caught, but then they get caught anyway. Hey, baby! <laughs> oh, 
Mom, your nana brought you home early. She got a kid. Brock, huh? That's a cool name. Here. Keep it up. <laughs> I feel so awkward. Not anymore. Okay. He fist bumped him. Yeah, he's cool. Okay. Brock is gonna go play in his room while the big people talk. He's gonna go play with his Legos and his- Is he gonna rethink it now? Since she has a kid? Hmm. ...is you not being involved in this at all. Well, it's a little late on that. This is what happens when you decide to pay our bills with drug money. Sometimes I don't like her pettiness, but he also thought he was going to die, which is why he got into it. My involvement in this is ongoing. Understand? So now she knows it's still going on. If you're going to launder money, Walt, at least do it right. Huh? You worked here four years. It's a business you understand. It's a story people will believe. She kinda has a point. But since when did she get like somewhat smart about this? She is a bookkeeper. She knows how to like do shit. But it's also like the illegal stuff. I didn't think she'd know how to do that. I don't know. When that girl do the deed yet? Do what? You know, sell to her. When you say do the deed, I straight up thought you meant the other shit. Pick your wording. I have magical powers. You want to see? Okay. Like that? That's science and stuff makes it do that. It doesn't even have a real explanation. Tomas does tricks with firecrackers, huh? Who's Tomas? He's my kid brother. Yeah? And we don't talk about it. Why? <sighs> I worked here for four years. Wax on, wax off. Was that you? Hey, how come you guys always give with the air? So he's actually going with it and listening to Skylar. Enough, you can make any story work. I, I once convinced a woman that I was Kevin Costner, and it worked because I believed it. Right? It has nothing to do with the story. But then it kind of does. He even tried to get Jesse to buy a nail salon, and that kind of made no sense. But it would have like just helped the situation, I guess. In other words, Danny can be trusted completely. That guy, the guy with the uh, the eyebrows that won't quit, is he a Danny? He got some bushy eyebrows. I thought maybe if you're holding, we can do something. What? She wants to do... Is he going to get offended because of the kid? He's gonna think she's stupid for trying to do it now? And you seriously wanna get high? I don't know what you're getting so pissed about. You're the one who brought it up the other day. Now he's changing his mind. Damn. Mom gets wasted with a little kid to take care of. That took a turn. You're right. I don't know what you've been through. You can tell me if you want. It seems like he's... There's some initiation or something. I made him kill somebody. 
Wait, so is he still alive? Some dude. So he did it. Told me all about it like it was nothing. That's at such a young age, bro. I'm some outside crew. Right around the corner from here. Would it would it have been the big dude that was in white that got shot by a kid the other episode? Am I right? When was this? A few months back. No way. Shot him dead. Just because he was working the wrong corner. He just learned how his friend died, bro. Named Schrader, comma, Hank. Who is going to be released at the end of this week. <laughs> Isn't that fantastic? He doesn't seem too happy. You'll be home. We do see the bedroom. I had him move the plasma in. I know that's how you always wanted it. You only had to get shot to get it right. I feel like he's about to go off because he doesn't want to leave until he's actually like walking on his own. Hank. I leave this hospital when I walk out of here. You understand? And not before. I just wish you would have said it more like in a nice way. But we get it. And get you another Danny to run the car wash? Easier said than done. If we're looking for someone trustworthy. I don't know why I thought she was gonna be like, I'll do it. But nah. What about me? What the fuck did I just say? What did I just say? Why? You're against it. No. Walt. I'm in this. And if I'm in it, I'm gonna do no. it right. You are not in this. She's getting herself into it. Reed, Skyler, we're divorced. You're divorced. She wants to get remarried? And she's done with Ted? Like that? Like, not that y'all should have got together in the first place, but it's like... I never actually got around to filing the papers. They both look dead. Like, I don't know, just the way they were staring, the way Jesse looked, the way that he was looking. They look lost. Uh huh. Yes. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'll be there. What's happening? Invitation to what? Whose house? Is it Gus's house? Walter, you're right on time. Please, come here. So I was right. It was Gus's house. But I never get to make it. Kids won't eat it. But, uh, you know how that is. I didn't know you had kids. We never know anything about you, bro. In this precise combination, the smell of this meal, instantly, it brings you back to my child. Neural connections are formed. The senses make the neurons express. I think this was hypothetical or like rhetorical. I meant rhetorical, but yeah. He'll explain anyway. That's very interesting. Walter, 
I would like to help you if I could. In what way? What advice do you have for me? Never make the same mistake twice. Meaning what? What mistake did he make the first time? I can't think. I can't think of what. It's a Jesse? That's where his friend died, I'm I'm pretty sure. And is that the brother? Three hundred. Who's that? Hey, sup? Were they the ones that weren't talking in the car or, or something? Like that episode that the friend died? Is that it? Damn. I swear. Wait. Why? Okay. I have to click out of this. But like. The way that like everything was connecting in this episode. I did not expect girl's brother. Little brother be the one that killed his friend months ago. Like, the fact that that connects. And then now, Skylar is getting in to like the money laundering and it's like, what changed her mind? Why? She was so against it and everything at first, but then now it's like, she's cool with it. So you put him, like, this might be a wrong way to put it, but it's like she put him through all of that. Just to basically, I don't wanna say change her mind, but she kind of changed her mind a bit at the end and now she's gonna be joining like the money money laundering and it's like yeah she protected ted whenever he did it but it's like now you're gonna join walt like what was what was the point of putting them through all of that if she was just gonna change her mind like mm, pisses me off like it's just it's just gonna be different to see her on like our side now in a way she's gonna be doing it for him like it just makes kind of no sense to me since she joined like yeah they couldn't find anyone else to help them launder money through the freaking car wash but to offer up yourself like none of this was even supposed to happen walt started this because he thought he was gonna die and yeah he still has like the chance since she's still like just in remission like he's not fully recovered but it's like what happens like if man does die then is she gonna still be in it like this is making me ask too many questions too quick <laughs> and wait this is episode 11 don't we have like two episodes left of this season I'm just glad this episode picked back up because yeah less like last episode was slow as fuck it was good but slow but this episode just like have like having everything pick up again and seeing all the connections and shit blew my mind loved it it was great I love that episode and it still just blows my mind how all of that just like went down but <sighs> Who else do we have to talk about? Hank. Hank is getting out of the hospital, but he doesn't want to because he wants to fully recover first. And I get it, but 
I feel like he could be a little bit nicer about it. But he's also like a prideful man, kind of like Walt. He, he doesn't want to be seen like that and having all that shit in his house. And it's like, I get it, but you also have to recover, Hank. Like, you can't not do anything. And like, it might be more comfortable to do it in your own home. But then, to him, it kind of seems like it would be uncomfortable, you know? So, if he wants to stay in the hospital and like, do it, power to him. He could do it. But that would also mean more money right not that we're trying to like worry about money right now but we still never got to see how much money it was i was curious how much it cost them and i'm never gonna fucking know maybe they'll show me next episode i don't know but it just had me really curious because i wanna i wanna know the price of that shit but anyways I have no idea what's gonna really happen next episode, so I guess come back for episode 12. <laughs>